As part of our commitment to Carolina's family, we're making sure you know the candidates running for South Carolina governor. We certainly are. We offered all the Democratic candidates and the Republicans three minutes of time in this newscast so they have a chance to tell you who they are. You can meet them. Well, tonight we are joined by Democratic candidate Phil Noble, and we welcome you to 7 on Main and 7 News, and we would love to know from you who you are and why you're running. Well, I'm just a uh, eighth generation upstate redneck from South Carolina <laughs> who, uh, who loves this state, and it uh, hurts me to see that our great potential of what we can be in education and health care and everything else is just being stymied by this broken and corrupt and dysfunctional system of politics we've got in Columbia. And it's, it's Democrats and Republicans, and it's a system of plantation politics where they take care of themselves and their cronies, and they tell the rest of us just tough luck. This is the way it's going to be. And we've got to change that because we're capable of just great things in this state. We've got great people. But we can't do any of that with this broken and corrupt system we've got now. So if you were elected governor of South Carolina, number one thing you would tackle would be? Well, after the corruption is education. Because if we don't fix education in this state, nothing else really matters. Uh, it really doesn't. And we've got to not just tinker around the edges a little more, a little less. We need to totally reinvent public education from not pre-K, but prenatal all the way to post-grad because the the reality is that our people are graduating from school and can't do the work we've got 60,000 jobs in this state that are unfilled simply because our people can't do the job and it's crippling us it's crippling our future as a state when it comes to um, the race for governor how would you describe your campaign if you were to kind of give people a, sure. a quick sense of it? Well, it's real simple. This is a race between state house politicians, Democrat and Republican, and, and corporate lawyers and their lobbyists versus me and my running mate. Both of us are not a part of that system. We're outsiders. We're, we're about change and reform. We're about trying to take the broken system and rip it up by its roots and institute real reform, radical reform, if you will, that can have a profound difference on this state. So it's not really Democrat or Republican. It's corruption versus reform. It's more the same versus something different. It's insiders and the status quo versus reform and radical, progressive, good change for this state. And in our last few uh, seconds of this interview, tell us why you think you're the right person for the job last 30 seconds. Well, it's because I've spent 30 years working around this state and local communities on projects to improve education, health care, promote gender equality, equal pay, equal work. I've seen just how great this state is and just what enormous things we can do if we first get rid of that broken and corrupt system in Columbia. And that's why I think I am uniquely qualified because I'm a part of real change that's effective on the grassroots level as opposed to the corruption of the state house. Phil Noble, Democrat running for governor of South Carolina, thank you for joining us. Thank you. Here at 7 on Main.